check this out. Let's see what they included. Oh yeah, look at that. All right, Tool Fam, so this is YouTube's largest tool unboxing. It is the biggest, largest tool unboxing. Yes, I looked into it. There's none bigger than this. Oh, not just this. That too. Yep, all of this. This was all acquired through deals or tips that you see on my channel. That being said, let's get right into it. Let's open the first item. That being said, let's get right into it. Let's open the first item. This is from Ohio Power Tool. This is the Metabo 12 volt interchangeable drill driver. Pretty neat. Comes with one battery. Looks like it has some charge straight out of the box. One, one bar here. Not bad. I like this. It has the ejector built into the drill itself. That's pretty nifty. Let's put it back. And this is the interchangeable chuck. If y'all want to see a comparison between this, the Milwaukee M12, and the Bosch, I now have them all. Let me know in the comments down below definitely something we can work on so this is the ninja hook that we did a deal on not long ago uh, pretty cheap I'm not expecting a whole lot here but uh, I'll give it a shot on the roof of my next flip if you're not subscribed make sure you are because I'm gonna be doing a bunch of videos using that house a bunch of tool demos you name it I'm gonna be doing it all right, look at this. Not bad. Let's put that blade down. So how's the, how does this work? There's no instructions in there. Huh, oh, okay. So it twists. And then you're able to lock it. I kind of get it. Kind of. I'm not a climber fam. Don't get mad at me. I am not a climber tool fam. So I don't know the ins and outs of this stuff. All I know is we're going to have a good time with this later. Wow, you guys are going to take that and run with it, aren't you? Let's put this away. Off to the side. Throw that in the box pile. Next we have the Ace... GMET laser distance pew pew. So let's take that right out of the box. It's got some nice plastic packaging there. Ooh, that feels nice. What is that? Interesting. Let's take the plastic off. I love this. It's so satisfying. Let's see if it works. Nope, gotta put the batteries in it. Comes with a little cloth pouch. Some batteries. Okay. All right. Let's give this a shot. So it works, and does it measure? It does. I don't know if y'all can see that dot in the back there. Let's see, we are seven feet away. Oh, and it keeps the other distance. So not bad. I do like little bubbles in there. It does not feel heavy duty. Feels pretty flimsy. 
But you know, it's a decently priced distance measure. I wasn't expecting, uh, you know, the Milwaukee distance measure, or the DeWalt or anything like that in its case and get it out of the way. Box down there. And if y'all want to go ahead and click off now, <laughs> that might not be a bad idea if you guys are bored by unboxings. This is a long one. We got the ABN Auto Body Now Tungsten Carbide Router Bits. Uh, fun fact about ABN, they are a legit manufacturer. Uh, Stan looked them up. Shout out to Stan. These should be good bits. And we got them for a steal of a deal, fam. Wow, that looks nice. That looks real nice. So it's going to come with all your standard bits. And they include, I like this a lot, the slot cutters and the rabbiting bit. So if you guys want to make style and panel or rail and style doors, I believe, this would be great. Also great for laminate counters. It's a good set. Subscribe to my channel if y'all like things like this. So let's put this uh, here. And let's get to the next, i.e. Safi. We did a deal on this about a week ago. It's here now. This is a solar battery bank. Shout out to Eugene for this deal. This was a pretty awesome deal. Let's check it out, see if it's legit. Ooh, look at all those solar panels. Ooh, it's charging already. I'm not even outside. That's pretty sweet, fam. It's like a calculator charger. All it needs is light. So I'm pretty stoked about that. Let's see what kind of connectors we've got. Got a couple of USBs and a USB micro. I mean, you're not going to power TVs or Xboxes or anything like that with this bad boy, but come on, fam. It's a solar cell phone charger here. This thing's pretty legit. Let's put that aside. From the side. And we'll keep going. Oh yeah, so those Carlisle pliers that I uh, talked about a couple weeks ago, uh, a couple weeks ago, last week, I believe I did this, they're here, alright, oh yeah, oh man, that's nice, if you want to see these go head to head, with the uh, Nipix, Knip, Knipix, Knipe, Knipe, you know, the expensive stuff. Let me know. I've got a set. We can do this. I've even got the Milwaukee's. Uh, I think for a fully loaded comp, we would definitely have to include the Irwins, but that's all that I'm missing, I believe. All right. Let's throw this to the side, put that down there, oh yeah, I know y'all saw this when I covered it, this was a steal of a deal, I don't know where else you guys are going to get an SDS hammer with two name brand batteries, the charger, and hopefully a bag, let's check this out, let's see what they included. Oh yeah, look at that. Team Bumblebee for the win, fam. Ooh, look at that. Got some instructions here. 
This should be... Ooh. How'd they do that? Some kind of magic. This should be the other battery and the charger. Yep, it is. Put that in there. Put that there. Put the instructions on the side. They make good grill starters. Oh yeah. I've got the Bosch Bulldog cordless. If y'all want to see those go head to head, let me know. This thing feels nice. Real nice. What the batteries come with? One bar. You got your hammer drill mode, your drill mode, and your hammer mode should be at the bottom. Ooh, it sticks. Can we get it into hammer mode? It won't spin to hammer mode. There it is. It's just a little sticky. All right. Let's pack that up. And put it to the side and... Oh, man, I should have had a third table ready for this. Let's start stacking things here. Next, we've got the Bosch Impact Driver Kit. I scored this one for $53, I believe it was, when that mad dash to Lowe's was happening a couple weeks ago. We're the ones who started it, fam. I'm sorry. <laughs> Not sorry? Full disclosure, I've owned one of these before, but it was the 12 volt combo kit. What? It's gonna explode! Put this to the side. Let's check our little bag. Some of these items have passed the return window point, so I hope they are complete. What do we have here? Should be the other battery. Alright. Rock and roll. Make sure it works. Yep. Need a charge, but works just fine. Let's chuck that out of here. And for those of you who are curious, this will be my last video from the shop. All right, fam? The last video because you guys have complained enough and my wife has heard you. And now I'm in trouble. <laughs> I have to clean this mess. So, next time. Stack that there. Some, something like this. Something like this. I fully anticipate this stack to fall over before the end of the video. Next up, we got the Metabo Triple Hammer 38. Now, I do have the 36 volt Triple Hammer right up there. For that last holiday season. Let's see what this bad boy comes with. If y'all want to see a comp between the 18 volt version and the 36 volt version, just so you can see what the difference is, let me know. I will work on one. Come on, Matabo. Oh, that's nice. It's almost identical to its 36 volt brother. And toss the box. This should be a nice tall pile by the time I'm done. We've got a Bosch work light 12 volt. I paid nine dollars for this bad boy. It's gonna go well with this. Let's cut this boy open. So, not a very sturdy light. This isn't even black. Looks like the hook is painted. Painted plastic. Painted plastic. 
but whatever a light is a light let's put it to the side looks like there's some docks in there no batteries or anything so let's just toss this i don't really need it and we've got another uh, huh. this shipped like this by the way this came from tools direct on ebay you guys know i i've done several videos on them they are my go-to for cheap milwaukee and dewalt things I know Stan recently bought a battery off eBay, and he had some issues. No! <laughs> so we took a tumble, but it looks like it's a perfectly fine 6.0. Y'all want to know what I paid for these? I did the hack. You guys can go back in my video history and find it. I've got like 400 videos, so good luck. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'll leave a link in the description. Maybe. For the set of two sixes, I paid... Uh, I think it was $86 with shipping and taxes. I think. I caught these at a good time. They sent me an offer. This was back when everyone was freaking out about the batteries i posted the six and the three combo for 65 bucks that ended up being a better deal let's double check this one okay so far we've done all this and we still have to get through all that this was a multi-volt battery that was sent to me for free via the Metabo uh, multivolt rebate. I bought this also on sale at Lowe's. I think I paid $56 for this one. And the whole reason I bought this was to get one of these for free. Let's chop this bad boy open. Oh, and shout out to Jeff Ostroff, because if it wasn't for him, I never would have known about the rebate program they had. This was way, way back in December, before I even started YouTube. So let's open this and check it out. Okay, we got some docks. We have one heck of a handle there. And wow, that's a beefy boy. Woo! This is a beefy boy, fam. Look at that. Woo! It's heavy, too. And they came with a double-ended Phillips head bit. Looks like both sides are Phillips number two. Let's throw that on the side. Toss the box. I haven't included every single item that I've bought. This is the M12 hammer kit. Fuel edition. Let's pop this bad boy open. Scored this one for. I want to say. I scored this for around $55. Let's check it out. Looks like it does indeed come with one battery, the hammer drill, and the charger. Let's open this up. Feels just like my other hammer drill. There's the two. Let's make sure it works. Huh? Everything seems to be good. Brand new, unused. Let's put it back. And wait for the day that we take this to town. I honestly don't know what everybody's hangups are on direct tools. Direct tools has only screwed up, I want to say, like twice. And I've bought at least 20 items from them. Uh, I had wanted to buy one of these for a while. This is a rotator, a ratchet rotator. So what happens is when there's an, an item or a bolt that you can't reach in your engine bay, you're just going to go ahead and put that in. 
and you spin the handle and it ratchets fam check that out I love that ratchets both ways can just basically go like that if you don't have any space to maneuver. I love it. This is a Craftsman Edition. They do have a Stanley version online. And it is reversible. Amazing. Next we have the M12 Fuel Oscillating Tool. I have several different oscillating tools including the Skill 12 volt. If y'all want to see a head-to-head -head on that, let me know. Oh yeah. Oh, still in plastic. Oh, that is so nice. So nice. Let's put that there. Got some docks here. Looks like they gave me a free... Uh, Milwaukee blade and a sanding attachment with pads. Next we have the Milwaukee snip set. I got this pretty cheap, 25 bucks for the three piece. These routinely go on sale. Just add them to a notification and when you see them drop in price, jump all over them like a cheap suit. There's one, there's two, there's three. And that goes in the pile. Yeah, I'm running out of space. Let's close these snips. These are the straight snips. Here we have the uh, left-handed, I want to say, left-handed snips, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, left-handed. There's the L. Here's the right-handed snips. All right, let's put these down. We did a deal on these Husky ratchet sets. Uh, I don't know if I should open them on camera or not, but uh, it was something that we did get, and I did get two of them. I saved one for an unboxing. fine. Three-eighths. Decent ratcheting action. There's a friction ring in here. Maybe it was part of the ratchet. Who knows? Let's try with a socket. Make sure that we didn't just accidentally break it. Nah, it's fine, fam. It's fine. Let's put that to the side. Let's put the sockets to the side so I don't lose them. Next up, we've got... Yep. The 6.0s from Makita. I did grab these myself. There were two sets there. I left the other set for somebody else to grab. Hopefully they enjoy them. All right. There's one. And there's two. Oh man, look at that. That is so satisfying. So clean. Should I charge these? No, nah, they'll be alright. They'll be alright. Let's stack these up here. Let's open this multivolt battery. Half a charge. Let me check and make sure we didn't get duds. Seems to work fine. Ooh, I like that. Maybe I should get a flex hammer drill and test that against it. It's been almost two weeks since the flex thing and people are still talking about it. Which, by the way, if you're still talking about it, 
That's what they want, fam. Until I bought that Flex Resip, I've only paid full retail price for a tool a handful of times. And that felt terrible. But I did it for y'all. I won't be paying retail again, not for a long time. Not unless DeWalt comes out with a new Gen Impact. Because, man, that 887 is tired, ain't it? So if you're out there, DeWalt, you're listening, send me a Team Bumblebee Impact Driver. A new one, please. This is supposed to be the M18 Fuel Grinder. I scored this for around... I don't even remember, it was so long ago, but this is a Tools Direct deal. New, feels brand new. Well, let's take this bad boy out. Oh, it looks like they might have used it once. Nothing terrible. Seems to work fine. Actuates. Let's see if we got everything else. We've got the blade guard, spanner, propaganda. Whoa. Yeah. It'll be fine. Fully charged. You stay there. <laughs> that came right off. <laughs> Works just fine. Looks like that might need a little tightening. Honestly, I don't see what the big fuss is about. It is a used tool, but it is fully operational. Sometimes you get brand new. Sometimes you get lightly used. I still believe that Tools Direct gets all the returns from Home Depot. I don't know how much longer that's going to last, but for right now that looks like that's the case. All right, good deal. Let's put that to the side. And let's keep going. We have the M12 Fuel Hacksaw. I got the, this on the video that I did the hack on the hack on the hack something like that a month and a half ago that I bought this thing hopefully everything's there but this came from Home Depot so it should be there right empty box nice bag let's get this bad boy opened there we go 4.0 unused hacksaw Propaganda, instruction booklet, all right, good deal. I don't have too many compact hacksaws, I've got this. I've got the Cobalt Compact, but that's a 24 volt, not a 12 volt. And I've got the DeWalt 12 volt. If y'all want to see a showdown between those, let me know in the comments down below. I promise I'm getting to all these videos, but it's hard to find the time. But if y'all keep bugging me about it, I will do it eventually. Now this one... I'm so stoked to open. This is the High Torque Friction Ring Kit. Oh man, I paid so little for this bad boy. I don't remember how much, but it wasn't much. And this was one of those uh, Tool Direct specials where you add it to your watch list and they send you an offer and you gotta click accept like right away because it'll sell out so fast. They've only got a few. 
You got to be quick on that trigger, fam. Come on. Let's go. By the way, if this video gets uh, a thousand likes, not a lot of likes, but a thousand likes, I'll give this bad boy away. Look at that. It's brand new. With a five. Not charged. Ooh, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> oh, yeah. Selector works. That's auto mode. First, second, third. Oh man, I'm so stoked. All right, tools direct coming through in the clutch. Oh man, feels good to be a gangsta. We're almost done, almost done. We have another Tools Direct special here. This is the installation driver. I don't remember what I paid for this, but I can guarantee you it's less than any hack or any Home Depot special. All right, let's cut this open. that open cut this open whoa nice case oh man i like that Look at that. Not even used. Maybe. Looks like maybe used once. We better check this. Looks like this was the battery they used, maybe. Watch all the heads are busted. Plastic off. Uh oh. Oh, it's locked. Speed one. This is pretty great, fam. It feels nice in your hand. Got the different heads, right angle impact. Maybe it's just a right angle. It's your chuck, Jacob's chuck, offset. This is your impact head. All right. Looks like tools direct, still directs. Next, we've got the Surge. This was already semi-opened from the post office, so let's get that the rest of the way. All right. Cardboard. Oh, no. Yeah, that's not the Surge. That's going back. For sure. I'll print the ship label right after this and send it back. Shouldn't be an issue. This will go back. So we've had one dud so far. This, I got this for 80 bucks. I know it says 100, I got it for 80 bucks. This is the Metabo HPT stapler. It is pneumatic. I don't really care for pneumatic tools, but 
I've always wanted to do some roof sheathing with a stapler like this, and I hear that this is a bad mamma jamma. So I hear. Now this should be brand new. I got it from the clearance rack at Lowe's. Oh yeah, look at that. It's so beautiful. All right, this one I'm gonna put back in the box. So I need it just so it doesn't get lost because I actually will use this one for work. Not that I don't use any of the other tools for work. It's just that some I use more than others. And we've got another, <laughs> yeah, I bought two of them. But that's because I also bought a flexi click. So let's get these open. I'll try not to cut into the hook this time. There we go. All right, let's put that with the other lights. These are not product reviews. This is a straight unboxing what's in the box type deal. If I went in depth on each of these tools, this video would be way too long. As it is, I'm kind of stretching it here, fam. We're getting to the hour mark. I really don't want to do that. I've got other things to do, and I'm sure y'all do as well. Now, this one was from Lowe's. It was a clearance item. They clearanced it down to 80, I don't know, 80 something. Y'all remember when I did the video on it? Oh, yeah. There it is. Flexi click, multiple heads, batteries. Works fine. Close that up. Comes with the other, I'll show y'all, the other battery right here just like that they are both 2.0s comes with the charger looks like they included some bits there close that up and I'll put it with the other Bosch right over here just like that just like that we've got the Galax Pro impact socket set this was the set that eugene gave us a tip on i believe we got this bad boy down to like god i don't even remember do you remember eugene i know you're gonna watch this i don't think you'll watch the whole thing but it was fairly cheap oh man look at that it comes with a metal case ha that's not bad yeah, that's not bad at all. Look at that extension. All big sockets. Oh yeah, this was worth it. Shout out to Eugene. Thanks for that deal. That guy's a tool wizard or something. Alright, next we've got a cordless combination hammer from Makita. This was yet another Tools Direct Special. So, hopefully we don't have, like, a regular Makita hammer drill in here, otherwise. It will be the second dud on this video, and we can't have that. No more duds. Cross your fingers that we're getting an actual Makita. Yes! 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 So it's been used. This is the second item aside from that grinder I've received that's used from Tools Direct. Looks like maybe they ran it one time, they didn't like it, they took it back, probably. Let's uh, chuck up a battery and make sure it works. Works fine on there. Let's check drill mode. Works fine in drill. Let's check hammer only. Why does it always stick when I'm trying to turn the hammer only? Huh. Is 
that why they took it back? The dial is stuck. So, I may have a defective Makita drill here. Let's see what we got here. Push. Push, use, push. Okay, push, use, push. Oh, there we go, look at that. Works fine, maybe the other dude didn't read the sticker. We've got some docks, some propaganda. Let's put that with the other fire kindling there. And a depth gauge. So, so far so good, fam. I am happy. This was an Amazon deal. The prices on the 3.0s, the pack, dropped to $53 for a fraction of a minute. I already had them in the cart. I just took them out, swapped the vendor. Here's a little tip for tool shopping on Amazon. Put stuff in your cart and then move it to save for later. If the price moves at all, Amazon will tell you. I don't know if other people have shared that knowledge with you. It's probably something I should have told you all a while ago. It's just slipped my mind till now. This is a brand new pack, 53 bucks, great deal. This will go with my other plethora of M12 batteries. I liked that set that I gave away so much that I had to get another one. Can't believe we're finally at the end. Oh yeah. Now, the zipper's not as nice as the fuel zippers, but I guess we can't have everything, right? So let's open this up. We've got a nice drill here, drill driver. Sorry. We've got a nice M12 screwdriver. This was a Tools Direct deal, and believe it or not, this is as cheap as that first deal that I put out for the drill driver, or I'm sorry, I keep saying drill driver, with the M12 screwdriver at 50 bucks. This was 55 with shipping and taxes on Tools Direct. Almost as cheap, but not quite. It is still a brand new M12 screwdriver. Two batteries, the charger, the bag, all that good stuff put this away oh yeah so all right tool fam that is the largest and biggest tool unboxing on YouTube now if you guys stuck around till the end I will be giving this away again for the second time so, M12 screwdriver kit giveaway, comment down below, just like before in this video, and I'll give this bad boy away in two weeks. Two weeks, all right? Two weeks. That's it for now, Tool Fam. Have at it. Good luck.